Welcome to everyone, everybody, uh, participants, participants who are here and the others who are, who are connected in this video uh, with video connection to this uh, conference. This event is uh, part of uh, Expo 2020 in Dubai and here in Slovenian Pavilion. Uh, we, get, we got a possibility to present in shortly our company and also our main product, which is DNA. Uh, my presentation, first part will be, as I said already, short presentation of the company and then short presentation of main focuses of this, uh, our product. And then we'll go in lieu presentation through our application. And then we'll make another video conference in, in this video conference. What is a big challenge? Uh, which, so we make uh, the simulation of audit with one company uh, in Paul in Slovenia. Uh, during uh, this, uh, if especially for people, uh, participants who are connected with, with video connection from all over the world, you can make questions by chat. And uh, we'll try to answer some questions. Uh, and uh, tomorrow uh, we'll, we'll send you email uh, with more answers on, on your questions. So Nets, uh, this company is already 30 years, almost 30 years. And uh, it's well known for efficient solutions. Uh, we started as a consultancy company with uh, many, well, also mostly in Slovenia. We finished more than 200 projects in Slovenia, but we worked also in the United States, uh, then in France, Belgium, Netherlands. And during this work, we found that, yeah, we try to uh, develop good IT support for our consultation. And nowadays, we are more IT company than consultancy. Uh, this IT support, which is a DNA, a Enterprise Quality Management System. Later on, I will just use abbreviation EQMS, DNA EQMS, or just DNA. So this is our application, which is also mobile. And I will explain, well, this implication is what is really challenging, or I found out that a big challenge for companies is to have clear picture of all processes. And in these processes, uh, the processes can be a good anchor for all uh, best practices, for knowledge base, for all internal rules, and so on. So you can have like a genome. This is one challenge of each company. And especially because I found out that the people uh, don't have common understanding of, of, of all processes in their companies, organizations. Sometimes this difference is even up to 30%. And then that can be caused for many mistakes. So this is first challenge. Another challenge uh, before we started to develop this application was, well, if I go in application, I would like to see everything from my point of view. So if I am user, I would really like to know uh, all my tasks, all meetings which are open for myself, all what is uh, waiting for, for me to do something. And also third challenge was, let's say I'm a manager and I would really like to see for all people who are under me, what they're doing, uh, that there's no need for me to ask them frequently, but I am able to follow what is their work, what they're doing just now. So these were two, three main challenges we try to um, develop or find good solution. And so there are five main focuses in this application. 
like overview of all processes, which is important for the organization. Then document management and risk management, task and meeting management, and compliance with different or selected standards, models, and so on. And underlying with organizational structure and H human resource management. And what is very important, all, all elements should be interconnected. So this is and uh, the main advantages of this uh, DNA EQMS system is that DNA works in all browsers. It is available also on mobile phones, can be suited for large and small companies, for production and service industries, it doesn't matter. For instance, we have uh, like companies in aluminum production, uh, then many pharmaceutical companies, then we have banks, uh, also uh, hospitals too, then can be, for instance, it's a public, uh, organization who checks uh, all companies connected with uh, air industry in Slovenia and so on. The DNA is multilingual, so you can work uh, the same time. For instance, uh, Impol has uh, 15 companies in three different countries and each uh, the employee can can work at the same time in the application, but each one in their own language. And also, we take care that DNA is constantly updated and connected with other already implemented systems in companies. So DNA is, is like a backbone of the company. Uh, we take really take care for security, but maybe about this uh, later on, I will get opportunity to our new partner because uh, just uh, recently we implemented also uh, this uh, video conference uh, in this application so you can be connected with the whole world. So this is very suitable to work on distance, what is great in this uh, time when COVID 19 pandemia is so strong. And uh, what is also very important, uh, it's very easy to, to put or to set rights to different persons and you can be aware of all time what are rights to, to employees. For instance, when I start meeting, I can see before I start meeting who will be able to has rights to see this meeting or I make I make a contract which is uh, confident I see again before I start to make this contract who will be able to see this contract so this is very important for us because sometimes uh, people are not aware who will be can, who will have rights to see what they're doing in the application Uh, uh, this uh, DNA can be connected with many different uh, applications like SAP uh, and the others. And so that's why DNA can be digital backbone of the company, of the organization. And mobility is very important. Uh, now I will jump in our application. So this, this will be in live. Um, now I see this, uh, everything from my point of view. I am Ms. Uroš Guncher. I'm a founder of the company. And now I can see everything what is important for myself. I can see what are, for instance, my uh, tasks. I can see what are my documents I'm involved in. What are, so this is shortcuts for myself. 
and these all meetings which I'm involved in now, my projects, uh, for instance, it is activity stream. I can see what is going on. And also, for instance, here I have all comments added for things which are connected to me in last three days and also all documents I have to know and to be familiar with. If there would be a blue quadrant, that would mean that I'm not informed with something. If there would be orange quadrant, that would mean that I still didn't uh, answer uh, someone in the processes or I didn't approve something. So for our company, it doesn't matter which organization use this DNA, it is important Then you don't have here blue and orange. Or this can be only for one day, not more. Other, so this is, uh, for instance, here I have this point as a user. I come in and I see immediately, like this is my desk, I see all information which are really extremely important for me. Uh, let's go now in uh, this first process of focus. I didn't go on upper level, which is where is complete architecture of all processes, but now I'm on process level. Uh, this is standard business process model notation 2.0, which is international. I can see all connections for these processes. For instance, this can start these processes. Oh, sorry. I will translate here. You, it is in English. It will be easier for us. Okay. And when I put myself on, doesn't matter which step, I got immediately all information I need for this step. This is short description. All executors or responsible, I say me has to do it or participant. I see which record is important here. And for instance, now you can see DNA. So I know this record is IT supported in DNA application because uh, DNA is also a perfect tool to to move on in with digitalization, I'm sorry. And then also here I have all uh, deeper links, for instance, documents, uh, links, for instance, uh, here I can uh, jump on all the uh, offers of my, uh, to our customers. I can see, for instance, uh, reference price list. I can see, for instance, requirements for placements and so on. So when you go, when you document uh, your process in that way, in visual way, uh, people are able to surfing through processes. Look, now I am surfing. I can see for all, all steps immediately what is important this step. And also for steps, for some steps where uh, the proposals are important, I can put proposals in this step. I can put risks if there are any. And also I have KPIs, key performance indicators. In this way, I really have like genome. This is how we plan to, to have our processes. This is first part. Then I will jump, for instance, this requirement. Now I am going in document management. Here I have this uh, content for this document. I, I can documents, let's say for this one document, I have all versions here. What is important or uh, the idea, each person, this person who is responsible for this content sh should be focused on the content, not the other things. Uh, for instance, uh, all versions, past versions are automatically stored. Uh, I can see also uh, who has to be familiar with this. And uh, I can change this very easy. Uh, then I can see also all what was changed in uh, this uh, version. And if I go, for instance, in the administration mode, mo I can see also uh, who has rights to see this document and also 
I can see the history of who, of all logs in. So I can see all people who were looking at this document in the past. So this is everything uh, mostly on tomato way. And here, here are these uh, folders. So this document can, each uh, company, organization, can make their own uh, structural folders and document can be in many places, the same document. For instance, you have one document which is connected to two processes and it's also in uh, three directories. When I change this document in one place, uh, immediately in one second, this document is in update uh, version in all other places. So it's, it's much easier. So you have to be really focused on content, not the other things. So this is uh, about a document. Oh, sorry. A management. Important part is also risk management. But now I'll go to risk man risks uh, through this process again. Look here, I have two risks. Again, I will translate in English with Google Translate. So maybe if, uh, okay, ability and for instance, risk and ability to do business. This uh, risk is positive. If you have too uh, too much uh, customers, then how to handle this risk? Here you have description of the risk. Then how uh, we manage this uh, risk? And also here are uh, evaluations of this risk. Then immediately I can have, uh, here we have all risks in our company. Uh, then I can look on my uh, dashboard of risk. I am, I have one risk which is not assessed and I am in 12 risk, I'm risk administrator responsible. So what what is the, the main point is that you have a really good overview over all risks. And uh, when someone evaluates, assess risk, all the others immediately have this information. And also you have color, uh, how important is risk. For instance, uh, green means, okay, it's everything is perfect. Uh, yellow is marginal risk. Uh, important is this in orange and uh, very critical is when the risk is red. So in short, what is risk management? Then I, I told already that uh, for this uh, focus is compliance. Uh, you have many companies which has to be compliant with different standards. For instance, here you can have let's say list of all standards in which you have to be compliant. Well, this is one we are just now, we implemented this. Here I can see uh, what is a requirement. And here is how we fulfill this requirement. Uh, sometimes uh, our customers, he didn't write anything, but just uh, make connections with different uh, elements in the DNA, where is uh, evidence is how you fulfill this requirement. What is important here? And here also, for instance, when this uh, requirement is the same in other standard. I saw uh, companies with, they had to be compliant with five, four, even six uh, standards. And it was not easy to manage. With this, they can manage quite easily, so they have the same answer for different standards. And we, what is important, you have to adapt all processes to yourself, to your customers, and not to standards. Sometimes that can happen, and it's not, it's not very useful for the company. And finally, there is uh, also task and meeting man management system, which is 
incorporated in the DNA. Uh, first, I will jump on this impulse. We will make simulation of audit with our uh, customer. And uh, let's take a short uh, video of Impol, which is aluminum industry. I believe they are one of the biggest in Europe. Uh, they are doing business in three countries. They are our customers more than 10 years. And uh, because they're doing products for automotive uh, industry, then air, uh, uh, air industry, airplane industry, it's very important. And for instance, they have more than 150 different products. And because uh, their customers expect for each product that they will have clear process definition, then a control plan, and also that they will make a failure modes effect analysis, FMA uh, analyze, analysis. And now count, you have one product, you have three stages, three sub-processes. So it must 150 uh, with three is 40, 450. And now imagine you must have three documents for each product. It counts 1,350 documents. And now you change something. You change in the main process any step. Then sometimes then you have to change 1,350 documents, what can take you a lot. We calculate it sometimes it takes more than two, three weeks to arrange everything. And now we, our solution, they have only three processes. And for each product, you can have version, versions. But you have to really handle three documents, three processes. In the same uh, document, you have flowchart, so the full description of the process, then you have completely co control plan, and also you, you have in, uh, integrated this risk analysis, so FMA analysis, all in the same document. Uh, and uh, now I will call this meeting with them. Well, this, we have all tasks. For instance, here I have all the history. Many tasks we made with them. Uh, many meetings, documents, projects, and but for instance, nobody uh, has done anything that those informations are here connected to company. So, so that's we are focused on subject, and when you're doing this, this content is connected with people who are doing this, with company for which is this, and so on. So many different perspectives, and. Well, I, I prepare in front this meeting. I invited uh, five persons. Uh, this is me, uh, my colleague, who will make notes for this uh, audit, and two people from uh, from Impol. There is also a third one, but uh, uh, IT person in their company who will. Uh, if they will be needed, uh, help a bit. 
so here I, I said this should be created with video call and now I can call. This is everything in real. Uh, our server is in Germany and what's really important for me, whatever happened should happen very fast. In our mind, when we call for something, we have this in second. If we cannot remember in a few seconds that we are already nervous. And so this is what, uh, now I, I made now uh, connections with them in real. Okay, so I can see here that Urosh was very fast on it because I explained a bit. And um, yeah. Uh, Urosh, uh, hello. I think Kara is, I believe with you. I think that I, I see her arm in your uh, right side. So we make uh, this uh, audit under uh, IATF standard, which is for automotive industry. And uh, as we discussed, that I would really like to know how you handle this uh, challenge to have a better solution for your technological documentation. And please, can you show us, uh, explain a bit more how you're doing this in Impo? Thank you very much for a kindly invitation. And also, we are very happy that we are participate on such a big event like an expo, especially uh, with the co collaboration with you, let's say for the comp with the company Nets, and also for the, let's say, really perfect document, document business solution which we are, let's say, discuss in the next few minutes. Uh, I hope we believe that you are hear us uh, very well. So we will now switch to, let's say, one of the example of the cases, but we prepare to you to share more behind knowledge, which is correlated to the sum of audits and also kind of document solution for the future, uh, let's say, use and let's say which is requested for the quality management system. If everything is okay, I will just share the screen, okay? Okay, please share your screen and... Uh... Yes, is everything clear? Yes, yes, we can hear you and see you. Thank you. Okay. In the next few uh, minutes, we will discuss about the general three documents, which is connected for the, let's say, audit and requested to the EATF standards. Nevertheless, we have a huge variation of the standards in the complete import group, which is, let's say, more than 2,500 people employee. So for every each process, nevertheless, that we are discussing now for the quality management system, we are taking consideration quite lots of documented variation which is connected with the manipulation, managing and also uh, behind information between the complete three group. We are separated definitely by the three different countries. So all the connection which is correlated directly in concrete to the document center, we are able to establish and we are just in time about the latest information this means which familiarity, which version, which indexing, what was changed, we exactly know in the moment of time. We are sharing to you some of the information which is correlated to our production process. If we are, let's say, see closer one of the, one of the overview of what we will discuss is a one extrusion press with the for the profile and bars in some of the condition which we are using in our process flowchart uh, representation. If we will jump to the overview of the video, we are discussing more closer about the production facilities, which is correlated to the billet, uh, cutting procedure, preheating, extrusion, uh, and the process which is correlated to the straightening process process for the automotive industry. Nevertheless, that we are, let's say, production process 
pre-scripting of the theoretical paper for the flowchart, we have concentration about the fully documented paper, let's say theoretical behind the request from the automotive and also representing the fully requesting procedure for the process with all the documentation and records behind that fully understand the request of the parts and also the customer for our portfolio production. This means if we are going to the process flowchart, we have every each process well done prescribed. And if we are stopping on the process flow number one, we see the general prescription of request which is necessary for, let's say, process step in one of the process flow charts. This means we are defined which kind of responsibility should be taken by the process. Then we have a fully prescription. This means which information system from the work order was defined. Then we are on the links, we are connected all the requested documents, which is control measurement protocol, work instruction, work safety construction, and so on. And we are every each process, we have behind some of the value, which is a number. Then is a few suggestion, which is correlated to the colors. We will discuss more later on this. Then which kind of, machine or hardware is used because all the documents connected to the direct press, what we are already discussed is conducted. And which characteristics is special in this process one is requested. Very important points of this that we also include the risk. This means that we have a fully prescripted FMA mode inside of the our documentation let's say center. And if we are going to proceed with a some more, let's say detail process, which is part of overview, we can also share to you the videos. This means particularly behind this process is every each step can be, let's say fulfilled with a video recognition. And also we can share to you also the fully prescription of one of the work order inside of the inside of our process. This means that we have a really good solution. So with the one click, we we are we have able to open all the requested documents which is contributed to this directly this project flowchart and directly to this let's say products or semi products. If we are open all the documents behind, we have a, let's say fully, full scription, what is requested from the automotive industry. And especially, this is a few sketch, we can also upload the photos in the files of the drawings with original files of the drawings. There is only one small example, which was cut out because of the NDA, NDA protection. So this means, that the owners and co-owners have a full, fully visible, uh, let's say, uh, documents. And also, so authors, this means which collaborate in this kind of documentation, this means complete team is also put it in the side of documentation center. All the process flowchart need directly involve two additional quality documents, which is one of this control plan. So we exactly by the head now in which kind of process we are in category of control plan, we are now inside of the production. We have uh, the date of the revision, date of production. Everything can be fulfilled so strictly. So in kind of all the process, we can also export inside and connect with the B2B of the customers. This means that the DNI is also possible to export some of benefits or requested cover sheet and also complete documents, which is necessary to share uh, to the customer side. Nevertheless, that we are discussing about the PIPAP level and so on. So the all documents and nevertheless, what we want is connected to the 
is connected to the export possibility that we can share to the customer side. If we open such a control plan with exporting, we can able to see the completely head and the reaction plan what is necessary with the fully prescription of the characteristic and the core team members and fully specified process part number and the characteristics characteristic which should be measured by the different methods and which control methods is co correlated or linked to the open documents center in inside of such a status. We have also revision in the head here. We have a completely name of such a process on control plan in this process, the page, and we have also in the owner and what is the status of the document. So we have on the head and the foot also complete status of the doc document inside of let's say updated modification through the different revision of the control plan. So we have a counting the number, we have a fully prescription, the process, every each step, which is linked to the flow chart. And we have a fully prescripted reaction plan, which should be taken for if some of the irregularities can appear in the operational procedure in the production. If we close, such a control plan. And if we are taking consideration also the FMA analysis and so on, we have possible also to prepare and export some of the FMA analyzers correlated to this portfolio products. And this is the this is the the next chapter what we have here. And if we open such a way, you will able to, to see by the complete also name of the complete documentation and the status, we have a, a risk management so more developed that we know in every each counter by the urban index, what this mean in the sites of failure mode analysis to avoid additional non-conformity of the product itself by the every each process step. So we have a fear developed and defined inside of DNA severity, cure, and detection index. This means that we have a well-known urban index. And this means by every each phases, we are prescribed this low, middle, and high risk for our production process to avoid additionally cost or different, let's say, excluded or possible or variation or potential claims for the future by the customer. Such a documentation can be shared also in one page, also to the customer side to evaluate and to see that we have all the information in one complete document, documented center, what we are discussing right now. If we are going back, we can also, this risk assessment test, fully prescript and define by the set of influences. This means uh, impact probability, possibility, and we have a wide variation how to rate these three colors that we are able to trace the prediction and also connection with the claim that we, the highly risk completely with the preventive and corrective action, which is also can be open here, lead that the risk assessment is lowest and minimum what is possible for the continuous improvement on the operational procedure. In this case, what we have here that we are discussing about the audit, we have a, by this EATF point showing the complete three documents, how we managing the complete system. So as you know, is already shown that we have a fully prescription of which revision and so on, what is the index in the guide, behind, which kind of intervention here is necessary. So we have a fully part of historical process to manage documentation and the external audits by the points for the requested, let's say filament, I will say directly, which is here, P8, we are discussing 
and the front of the operational process see what is the real connection of the theoretically, uh, let's say, prescription to the physically evidence of the pro production itself. This is something that we establish by the latest development. So all the solution is completed and confirmed for the EATF, this means automotive industry and also other uh, industry, which is like a space shuttle industry and so on. So with this, we are completely managing the process documentation system with a quality management system from the documented center till the operational check inside of production. Uh, Mr. Work, yeah. yeah. I Please. saw you show a few recommendations for uh, this process as well. Yes, we have already, uh, if we are going in the count of the audit, we can also put in the DNR system recommendation. Recommendations or the status, if the something is appear like a minor or major, we have a fully evidence here. So the DNR system have the complete audit possibility tracking system that we in every each, let's say audits plan, nevertheless, by the quantity, nevertheless, about the standard itself, linked results with a correlated point inside of, inside of the quality management system, what we're discussing right now. A recommendation for this particularly is that we have connect not only the claim, let's say inside of the MFA to decrease with the action the risk level. We have also recommendation that we uh, connect the color of the status if something's missing by the action with the, let's say yellow, red or green uh, with the standards of the control or, or the operation. And we have also possibility to count the process itself by the standard of the geometry preparation of the flowchart and control method behind the QM system inside of DNA. Have, uh, am I uh, answered to your question? Yes, yeah, thank you very much. Uh, I believe this uh, simulation of audit is enough just to give them impression because in this uh, COVID time, a pandemia, it's really useful to have possibility to work on distance. Uh, I have to say we, we wanted to use uh, smart glasses, but because some um, their customers, because of security, they didn't allow us to, to, uh, to, yeah, to show uh, too much in your production. That's why we, we said, okay, we'll skip this uh, smart glasses, otherwise you can, uh, okay, direct person in the production and you are on the other side, for instance, in BMW, in Munich, and you can uh, tell, sh sh go there and there and uh, just show me everything. Uh, uh, the production uh, layouts, uh, the recommendations, so on. And this then can be even uh, more experienced to this audit in distance. Yes, this is a huge benefit, uh, let's say, nevertheless, of the live stream, like you already exact, because we are going not only for 4D digitalization, we are on the uh, just in time, let's say, have possibility to prepare the audit, which is directly to connect as you, as you already have a solution with, the, uh, let's say, mobile phones and so on, that we have a completely fully lit agenda with the audit. And we are front of the, let's say, glasses directly transformed for the lifetime operation inside of production. So in the just in time, we are both have complete, let's say, undertaking the solution and the status which have been considered on the audit itself. And this is a, one of the really huge implementation, I will say, and the future benefits to make the completely audits also by the, let's say, different location in the same time, especially for the company, when the process between the country have been continued, this means that the one part of the production is prepared only in one country, and then let's say material transformed to the, 
let's say, major country where the semi or final product is uh, prepared and delivered to the customer side. So this connection is really, really good. Thank you, Mr. Kovacic. Thank you very much. Now we'll close this okay. meeting and I will send you uh, this meeting uh, minutes. Uh, I will show how we can send you immediately after such uh, audit. Uh, thank you very much again and uh, see you. Bye bye. Have a nice. Thank you very much also. Uh, now, now we are here. We we finish this audit. Oh yeah, I have to refresh because uh, my colleague uh, make notes about this uh, this audit. Now, here we put two two recommendations and also the record important details about what we, we heard from the, our customer. And now I can, uh, I can finish this. Uh, okay, now I, I finish the meeting and I can send minutes. I will, let's say, I don't need this one, but I will uh, send to those four persons. I sent also to myself. You see here, uh, this uh, DNA sends this uh, meeting minutes to all four. And if I want to see, I hope this. So this is this, and I can, I can see the, meeting minutes. So everything is connected. This can be professional. Well, now it's because it's in our DNA, it's our template. Otherwise, this template can be, if you have your own uh, DNA in your company, can be your template for that company. So this uh, meeting minutes is, uh, what is important? Everything should be fast. And now I'm going to, to the company. Impo, what is, now you see immediately I have here those two recommendations. But those two tasks are not only in the company. Those two tasks are all, all also, for instance, if I'm going to see who is responsible for this one, okay, this one is uh, Tinkara Smolar. So this uh, task is also on Tinkara Smolar. And uh, the other one, I think that you pointed uh, to Uros Kvacic. So everything what is happening, and this, uh, this task is also in my uh, map, in Tinkara map and in Impol map. So everything immediately. This is very important. So I don't, when you, you set everything in your DNA, then you must be focused only on content. No, no, no more where, else, where this uh, information will be, because this is automatically. Well, this is uh, about this. Uh, it's very strong uh, task and meeting uh, management in the company. And uh, well, this is uh, in short, oh yeah, uh, this video conference. Yeah, because we recently, we incorporated uh, this uh, video call in meeting. Uh, well, you already saw how this works. And uh, why d we did this? Uh, because we're really uh, focused on security. And if uh, France, uh, if you are here, maybe you you could explain a bit more about this uh, new functionality in DNA, and also you can uh, put some focus on security and uh, data protection. Uh, is uh, Franz with us? Yes, I'm with you. Thank you very much for letting me uh, join you. Um, I'm, I'm also sitting here with our colleagues from Impol. 
It was fantastic presentation. I'm more from communication side. We would just like to stress that what we are doing today on the platform called Meetim, together with our colleagues from DNA, is really finding a, a very special solution, fully optimized for professional circles. We are not a consumer uh, technologies together. We are really focused on specialized companies which really want to protect everything concerning that people. I want to show you just one slide. Uh, just a second. So Meetim is now one of the modules of DNA bringing the complete functionality of secure digital and customizable collaboration learning. You could say, we try to do the same like big players like Microsoft Teams, Zoom, Webex and Slack are doing, but we want to do it in a different way. Uh, if they are sort of hotel room, we are really my home type of principle with full security. So everything what you do with your data, with your content, with your videos is fully securely stored in your servers. It's not protected by 20 pages of a small print of the of the lawyers. It's really protected by old fashioned means. This data is here and it's fully protected. So the components which we are integrating now between DNA and Meetim are the following. So Meeting can provide a virtual spaces for collaboration, can provide a great digital content library for multimedia and interactive content, which can be viewed, of course, through uh, the secure file systems like Nextcloud or through secure uh, document systems like DNA document system. It can be equipped with a notification engine to really send all the information about the new content so you can create your library of all the recordings and later on process them through DNA workflows. You can have fantastic tracking of all the usage of everything who is every second of somebody who is recording or watching this is tracked and can be analyzed using different uh, analyzing uh, BI tools. So the communication model like we are using today can be fully customized into a very special workflows with usage of a device like uh, smart glasses from Vuzix or 360 cameras or interactive whiteboards and so on. So it's really going towards professional circles. Uh, of course, you can provide file sharing like Nextcloud or chat. All of this is based on a lot of open source components, but being put it together in the last five years with a full focus, let's do the tricks of the big global players, but put them together in a more secure and more customizable way. You can create your learning environment from this. You can create your creation studio. You can have your events going on and all sorts of events like big or small, like the one today, or, or a, a huge sales conference for 10 days. And you can have your community, which is working on is finding each other, like a small private LinkedIn. And uh, that is uh, with, of course, full support of customization. We are very happy that the philosophy of secure and customizable and extreme user friendly principles, which DNA is really pioneering, we are intending to fully support our colleagues with uh, collaboration tools to really come out with absolute unique uh, full scale solution. Thank you, Urosh, very much for this opportunity and good luck to all of you. Bye bye. Thank you, Franz, for your uh, brief explanation. Maybe, yeah, uh, maybe I didn't show you enough how everything is interconnected. Uh, just one case, for instance, oh, I'm sorry, I should, here, we saw this process, for instance. Now I have, I will go this, Again, you have to translate. So. Translate in English so you can, it's the developer engineer. Let's say here I have two engineers. I'm going on Alexander Kluczewski, which is one who came uh, last one. And now you can see his in this uh, workplace and have many other roles like risk manager, mentor, project team member. If I'm going here in process tasks, I can see immediately then he is involved with these roles. He is involved in 58 steps in processes like participant, assignee, employee, developing engineer, and so on. So, 
everything is so connected. When I describe processes on the right way, then I, I can filter and have what, whatever expert I want to see through my processes. This is extremely important. So I am able as a manager to see who is really, uh, or well, who works a lot, who don't, who doesn't, and I can manage my, my people better. And, uh, for instance, uh, this is everything more or less automatically. Well, in short, uh, for instance, we didn't uh, go through projects. When you have all documents, you have all tasks and meetings combined together, you can really manage whatever projects you have. And uh, before, I don't know, uh, 15 years ago, I was not able to follow, I don't know, 10 projects. Now I go in the project, I can see in a few minutes what is going on, where the, uh, where the status is, what is finished and what is not finished in the project. And I don't need to call anyone. So this is short presentation. Thank you very much to be here and also people uh, from all the world to take time and uh, join us in this presentation of DNA. I believe in the future will come even better. Thank you very much. Uh,